boy, what a mess. He's got my leg, he's got tangled, oh my goodness. All right, so we're down here catching bait. We're headed to Crothersville, Missouri for the uh, Bellas King Cat this weekend. As always, number one thing on my list is bait. So that's what we're here doing today. Bait's a little tough, but that's part of the game. We're using a uh, these little yellow, they're called shiny heinies. You can get them at Walmart. They're just a hair jigs, all they are. They really like, seem to be liking that yellow and red today. Oh my goodness, what a tangle. What a tangle, what a tangle. But, using a Cadence CR5, rod it's six six medium medium fast got it paired up with a cadence cs7 reel if you guys don't know much about cadence you ought to give them a look they uh i like to you know support companies that, that support the fishing industry and one thing i like about cadence is their motto is go fishing and give back so any any rod and reel combo that you buy that's over fifty dollars or any fifty dollars that you spend collectively they're going to donate a kid's rod and reel and anybody that knows me knows that you know i love to get kids in the outdoors i mean that's the future of our sport that's the future of fishing and the whole industry all together so so that's the reason i support cadence and i, I urge anybody that is you know, wanting good quality gear anyway I had to go look them up and it's cadence.com but you can only buy this stuff online and they do that for a reason that way they can kind of keep the price of the quality you know gear down um, it's not going to cost you you're going to get the same quality for about 30 to 40 percent less so and to me that's that's good because i i catch a lot of bait throughout the year and instead of just buying a cheap you know 20 or 30 dollar reel rod and reel i can spend a little bit more uh, get a kid's combo to donate somewhere and have quality gear so if i can ever get this untangled I'll get back out there and see if we can't catch another Big old hold skipjacks.
Oh yeah, these things are going to make some great Mississippi River blue cats. Oh yeah, I cannot wait. Cut this baby up, do some back bouncing down to Mississippi. It's going to be great. These things stop tangling me up so much, I might be able to catch more quicker. Alright, now we got that tangle out finally. What I'm doing is I'm throwing it up in to the boil. And uh, for some reason, they're wanting really slow I got a little bit heavier weight on it kind of letting it sink down a little bit and then bringing it to me in the current uh, I was setting up above the boil and throwing you know kind of into the boil and to me in the current but they didn't want it like that they wanted it kind of deeper and uh, slower so we're throwing into the current and letting it come back to us and trying to just kind of keep up with it and uh, the bite is not hard more so than you just kind of lose the bait so that's how we're that's how we're catching them today. Like I said, it's slow, but but they're there. They're just kind of deep. There's a bunch of little ones, and uh, they're below those little ones. So get back at it. See if we can't catch some more. to the collection. next couple days anyway so I'm gonna cut it short on the bait I'm gonna play my cards the weather's supposed to be pretty nice the uh, next couple days supposed to be about the same so I should be able to come back here Friday and catch fresh bait and uh, that's kind of what I was mainly wanting to find out is if there was bait in here so remember whenever you guys are out you know skipjack fishing one you know to try different things you know uh, there was a bunch of small ones in here. It was tough. You know, I tried different things, different colors, uh, different depths until I found them, different areas up in here. But they was here, it was slow. It took me a while to catch them all. But thankfully, we got bait. We're heading to the Mississippi River. Next time you're on the water, make sure you got good fresh bait. And uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.